Hello everyone, welcome to Key to Blogging and in this video I will show you how you can add a cookies consent pop-up in your WordPress and Blogger website. So let's check how you can add this cookie consent pop-up in your Blogger website. So to add this you have to go to your Blogger website and here click on theme section. And before proceeding further you have to take a backup of your theme. So in case if you do anything wrong in this process then you can easily restore it by copy and pasting the backup code. So here I will scroll down to the bottom and search for closing body tag. Now I have to copy a code like this. So just copy this code. So it will disable the previous cookie consent pop-up. So just click on paste and then you have to copy the CSS code. So let me just copy the CSS code and I will find the CSS code in the theme section. So let's scroll up and here it is. So these are the CSS code. So let me just find a space around it and I will paste it here. So make sure to paste the CSS code just above the B skin tag. Now let me just copy the HTML code from here. And I will go to the closing body tag and I will paste it above the body tag. Now let's go to the code and here I will copy the JavaScript code and I will paste it after the HTML code. And here you can adjust the cookie consent message and here you can add a link. So before that let me just save this code. Okay, now the code is saved. Let me just copy the blog URL and I will open it in a incognito mode. So make sure to open the website in incognito mode. And let me just scroll down. And as you can see, the cookies consent pop up is showing. And here you can add a learn more link. So here basically you can link this button to a privacy policy page. So let me just go to the template and let me just search for privacy policy. So I will go to the pages section and I will copy the privacy policy link here. And I will go to the theme and I will click on edit HTML. And here I will scroll down to the bottom and I will find the learn more section. So here in the hash value, I will change the privacy policy link. Now let me just save the code. Now again go to the incognito mode and I will refresh this page. Now scroll down and as you can see the learn more button link is now added. So if you click on accept cookies it will gone for 30 days. So once you accept the cookies the cookies consent pop up will be gone for 30 days. So you can also further adjust the date like let me just go to the coding and let's search for the JavaScript code. So here this is the max age. So you can change this number. So as you can see this is in second. So you can change this number to your own value. So this is basically set to 30 days. So once you click on the accept cookies it will turn this cookies consent button permanently but it will not store the cookies as we open this website in incognito mode so let me just open the website here and i will open a page from here and scroll down and there is no cookies consent pop up let's click on home page so once you click on accept cookies it will gone for 30 days and once let me just clear the cookies from here so i will click on remove and let's click on refresh now scroll down and here as you can see the cookies consent pop-up is showing so let me just open a blog post from here now scroll down and as you can see the cookies consent pop-up is showing and once i click on this button it will gone for 30 days so in this way you can add a cookies consent pop-up in your blogger website and you can also add the same code to your wordpress website so 
here you can use any plugin like header footer manager so let me just click on add plugin and i will search for header footer code something like that and you can install any header footer manager so i prefer 99 robots header footer code manager so just install this plugin and you can paste this code in the footer section or you can go to the appearance section and here click on theme file editor and here you have to search for footer.php now scroll down and here this is the closing body tag so you can paste this code above the closing body tag and make sure to add the style tag here so here i will add the style tag like this and i will scroll up and i will add the style tag just add the style tag above the css code and close the style tag after the css code now you have to copy the whole code and paste it above the closing body tag after that it will be added in your wordpress website so let me just add this code so let me just copy this code from here and i will paste it here now i will click on enter and i can add the html code from here and i will click on enter and let's add this javascript code now click on update file so before changing anything make sure to take the backup of your footer.php file or take a full site backup of your wordpress website in case if you do anything wrong in this process okay now let me just visit the website and as you can see the cookies consent pop up is now showing and here you can click on accept cookies to close this so in this way you can add cookies consent pop up in your blogger and wordpress website so let me just remove this cookies consent pop up and let's refresh this page and if you have any doubt regarding this then you can ask me in the comment section and you can also further customize the color and the border radius etc so let me just show you how you can customize the color so to customize the color you have to search for the css code and here you can see this option like background color so you can change the background color here and here you can adjust the width padding etc so just right click on it and here you can adjust the background color like this and if you find this content valuable then make sure to hit the like button and i will see you in the next video thank you